ECOSA was constructed as the Millennium Project back in 2000 to showcase emerging renewable and sustainable energy projects. By 2014, a lot of the technology that was within ECOS had reached the end of its life. The Council had identified the need for new industries coming into the area and decided that they wanted Catalyst to run their building as an innovation centre. The ECOS building incorporates meeting and conferencing facilities, totally refurbished. But more importantly, it now provides a new workspace accommodation. ECOS sits in 150 acres of park space. There is the All Ability Cafe uh, on the site, which is open to the public. We have aspirations with the council to create 125 uh, high-tech jobs uh, within, within the building. We're well on our way with that, with that over 90 at this moment in time. The elected representatives of Mid and East Antrim Borough Council made a multi-million pound investment in this innovation hub at ECOS. There are local businesses that have grown and grown and many of them now trade worldwide. We're Clark Facades, uh, we work in the construction industry and we provide building envelope services to main contractors in Northern Ireland and in the UK. For us, there were two main benefits about being based in Balmina. The first was to attract the top talent from all around the North Coast and Belfast. The second was to position ourselves in such a way that our clients would have ease of access to us, the main arterial routes. It was a perfect strategic location for us. Since moving to the ECOS, the turnover in the company has went up by 30%. We've also added 15 new employees to the company. Without the significant investment from Mid East Antrim Council into the ECOS, we wouldn't have had the chance to move into a grade A office space such as this. One of the best things about being in the ECOS is access to the community and support networks provided uh, both through Catalyst and through the, the Amplify program. We find those invaluable in pushing our business to the next level. The flexible leasing arrangement that Council and Catalyst provide meant that we were able to create the perfect environment for our business to thrive. My name is Sean McAllister and I am CEO at Plotbox. Running a global business from Ballymena here at Catalyst, it's actually really exciting. Northern Ireland is actually a great location because you are in the centre of all the time zones. We operate in the west coast of the US and we operate in Sydney in Australia. There's nothing I'd say that would give you a limitation in working in Northern Ireland to go to a global level at all. The talent is here. Being here locally, having local contacts, um, knowing people personally is such, such a great start from being able to operate here um, in Northern Ireland globally. The Innovation Hub is doing what we needed to do and that we've already seen one business outgrow. The Innovation Hub was made possible by working in partnership. Partnership with Catalyst and with all of the great businesses that have taken part in the Hub. So the support that Catalyst provides is to help our brightest and best entrepreneurs to get advice, to get access to markets, to get access to critical resources that they need whenever they need it from an amazing community that we've got. We are as good, if not better, than the people from anywhere else in the world. All we're trying to do is build a platform that helps them to win and succeed because they are amazing. I am pleased that we have secured £26 million from the Belfast Wider City Day to actually implement Phase 2. At the heart of Phase 2 is the rolling out of more Grade A office space and I look forward to actually making this a reality.